Hey guys, this is Ghost Pit Miner coming at you live from the power of YouTube through the internet itself. Okay you guys, so today we're going to see how much it costs to run a one card rig using one of the best devices I have. It's called a kilowatt. Okay guys, so one of the first things you want to do is you want to plug the kilowatt directly into the wall socket. So just like that, it's going to go ahead and turn itself on. Um, first thing you want to do when you are installing the kilowatt EZ is you want to hold restart. And it's going to restart. You want to do this every time you move it. Uh, second thing you want to get into is you want to hit set. Hold it. So right now I have it set to 10 cents a kilowatt because that's how much my electricity cost is. So that's good. So I'm just going to hit that again and it's going to say save real fastly. And the next thing you want to do is you want to plug in whatever you want to um, check for the, the price, the cost of electricity. So what I like to do is I actually like to use a power strip. So I'm going to plug the power strip directly into the kilowatt. So now, in the future, I can run everything on here. So I can run, uh, let's just say, two um, power supplies and um, a fan and also a monitor. So I can actually see how much that's going to cost me. So I'm going to go ahead and plug in my monitor. Okay. And my power supply is already plugged in. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and, sorry about the lighting guys. So now what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm going to go ahead and uh, turn on my mining rig. Okay guys, so I'm going to go ahead and turn on my mining rig. And with my mining rig, I have this little switch right here. So I just push this. And again, what I like to do when I do turn off my machines, is I make sure to turn off the power supply first. So see right there, just turn it back on. Hit this little switch. And there we go, we're up and running. So what we're running on this one card mining rig, it's actually an EVGA 1060 Super Super Clocked Edition. I got this one from EVGA directly for $150. Oh God, that would be amazing. Sorry guys, I got this directly from EVGA for $250. Um, this was on the, blue, the B product list and it came in a box like this. The first one right here is, is the top EVGA one. Um, so it's going to go ahead and boot up. I am running it off a hard drive, so it's going to take a little while to boot up. But again, um, this whole mining rig right here was to see what is the cheapest mining rig to make. Again, cheapest to make. So just keep that in mind. I'm not going for the fastest machine ever. And um, this does cost a little bit more to run um, than a SSD. Just a little bit. I think it takes about three years to equal up the price to an SSD. This hard drive only cost me $16. That's with tax and shipping. So <laughs> that's pretty pretty awesome. Um, by the time it hits the equal amount to buying a uh, SSD, it's gonna be like three years down the road. Um, yeah, so nothing to worry about. By then I'll, I'll buy another one or buy an SSD. Uh, this one right here is running a SSD. So anyways, I'm just trying to make the cheapest mining rig possible. Um, so after I have it running, on a, um, after I have it running for Zcash, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait about 30 minutes and see how much it's gonna cost to run this machine to see if there is a profit I'm gonna be making off this machine. So let's wait for this machine to boot up. Okay guys, so we have the mining rig up and running. Um, I just put a little uh, overclock on the, um, the memory and an overclock on the core and we're getting 340, uh, 343 solutions a second on a super super clocked edition from EVGA. And it's just a 1060 uh, 6 gig, which is pretty pretty good. I have a, actually three other ones that are not as powerful as this one. So uh, on one of my future videos, I'm gonna do a comparison versus a super clocked edition, a super super clocked edition, and a for the win edition, all by EVGA, and they're all gonna be 10, 60, six gigs. Um, again, trying to make the cheapest, most profitable mining rig here. So I'm gonna go ahead and let it run for about, let's say 30 minutes and I'll come back to you and I'll tell you how much it costs for uh, one of these one card mining rigs a month a year and how much you actually make in the long run with this uh, one card mining rig.
Okay guys, so I've been running the mining rig for about 30 minutes now. Um, I unplugged the keyboard and I unplugged the monitor so it can be, again, just the mining rig. Now this is a one Martin, uh, this is a one card mining rig. The motherboard is an Asus Z170E motherboard. And again, the um, CPU is a Pentium Intel Core processor. Uh, the power supply is the 850 EVGA BQ edition, and I'm running two gig. Uh, sorry, I'm running two four four gigabyte uh, RAM cards to make a total of eight gigs of RAM, and they're from A Data. And I'm using one card on this mining rig from EVGA, and that's a 1060 super super clocked edition. The and it's the uh, six gigabyte one. So. Again, it's averaging about 201 watts at the wall, and this is from the whole mining rig. So what you wanna do after you get out of this watt, you wanna go over here and click, you wanna go over here, and you wanna click menu. That's gonna put you for the price. So right now it says zero, so you wanna go down right here. A yearly cost of $176. A monthly cost, this is the important part, Again, normally what I do is I look at the monthly cost uh, to run this machine. So it's $14.47 to run a one card 1060 six gig rig. And I am using a hard drive that uses a little bit more electricity. We'll probably do a price comparison on that too. We'll compare a hard drive versus an SSD uh, and cost. So a weekly is gonna be $3.37 to run this rig. A daily cost of 48 cents so we're gonna go back to this number right now we're gonna pull up uh, crypto compare we're gonna see how much we're making with this card again I'm mining Zcash and I'm mining 340 souls um, a second so we're gonna look into that and see how much we're gonna get on today's market hey guys so we're on crypto compare and we're looking at Zcash so right now as of March 6 2018 at 9 p.m. Zcash is worth $386.02 for one coin. So uh, we're, we're using Nanopole and we're mining with a 1066 gig super super clocked edition from EVGA that cost me $250. So we're gonna go ahead and put in 340 solutions a second. We're gonna keep power consumption at zero and pop, uh, price per kilowatt at zero and pull fee is actually two uh, percent um, when you're mining on nano pool. So remember what we we're looking at before guys, it's costing us 48 cents a day to mine Zcash. So 48 cents, and our daily profit is $1.52. Um, so let's go ahead and minus that. Then that's after the mining fee. So let's look at that. So $1.52. So you can see the proof right here. Minus 48 cents a day. So you're looking at a total profit after deducting electricity costs for the whole mining rig. You're looking at $1.04 a day. So you times that by seven. You're making $7.28 a week. And you sign, if you times that by four, you're making $29.12 a month. Okay guys, so let's see how long it's gonna take us to hit our ROI. So remember this card was $250, so you're gonna do $250 divided by $29. Oops, let me go back one. So you're looking at eight months, um, Almost nine months to hit your RI on this one card, and it's a 1066 gig. But keep in mind, guys, um, the, the amount of Zcash right now is $386. Back in December, it hit a high of $800 for one Zcash. So if you think about it, guys, you're mining for the coin. You're not really mining for... Um, you're not really mining for a money aspect unless you're catching, cashing out. So at $45 a month, um, 
you know, it's not too bad of a deal. Uh, but you can see how much electricity electricity does play a role in this. So your regular profit, you go from, let's see. So you're going to minus $45. So $16 in electricity a month, that's what you're looking at to run a one card rig. Um, but again, what's going into your bank is gonna be uh, $45.73. That's what you're putting into your bank. Um, that's how much this card is making you. Um, but after expenses, you're only making $29 a month off this one card, and it's gonna take you almost nine months to pay it back. So that does sound kind of crazy, but guys, once you add more cards to your mining rig, you do make more money. So my plan is actually to run seven of these cards on there. So I'm gonna go 300. So this is when you're gonna start actually making some money when you run some more cards. Times seven. So 2,380. So let's see how much we can actually make off this one. So you'll be actually making $320 a month off this um, mining rig. So that's when you start getting into some better numbers. And uh, this is my second mining rig. So again, I'll be making about $1,000 a month with both of my mining rigs, which is awesome. Um, it's free money. And the best part about it is if this market ever does crash, what you can do guys, is you can sell your GPUs, your CPUs, your, your DDR4 RAM. You can sell all those. But if you invest with money into cr uh, cryptocurrency, you can't get that money back. If the bubble bursts, guys, you can't sell a shit coin. Sorry for that term, but you can't sell a coin that's worth zero dollars and get a profit back. But you can actually sell a GPU for some profit back so you can get your money back. So think about it that way, guys. When you're actually getting to any type of cryptocurrency, there is a high rate of volatility in this market. The market goes up and down on a daily basis sometimes up 60%, sometimes down 60%, sometimes up 5% in months. So you have to think about it that way. Um, you're actually, if you're getting into cryptocurrency, it is a type of gambling. So there might be a 50% win, might be a 50% chance of losing. Nobody knows, okay guys, this market is very volatile. So just get into it with this in mind. Never put in as much as you're not willing to lose, okay? Again, I only invest 10% of my income into crypto mining, okay? Um, so it's more of a hobby for me right now. I am making about $400 a month with both rigs running. Um, you know, it's not a bad deal. So anyways, guys, if you want more videos like this, please like, subscribe, and share. And don't forget to leave a comment below if you have any questions, concerns, or issues. Or also, if you have a better way to mine, let me know or anything like that guys i'm always up to do a new video thank you guys i'm out see you soon bye